Hello everybody, welcome to CCL Season 52 Playoffs, a second round. We've got Diomed and his Roger for Dimmy amazing meme team. Um, it looks like he's going to carry on the road. What the hell is the Roger doing back here? Amazing. <laughs> Did he swap these by accident? Like, surely, right? This is an accident. Surely the Rogue was meant to be on the LOS and the gut are back. This is so bizarre. Um, maybe he's doing a Daka. Maybe, yeah. Oh, yeah, maybe it's a Daka. Oh, it's a Daka. Yeah, it's a Daka. But then why, why is this guy in the LOS? I don't know. But um, there you go. It's it's Diamond with Skaven versus Crag with um, und Necro, <laughs> Undead Necro. <laughs> and in the booth with me is Fimey. Hello. Hello, everybody. What a game we have here. Uh, we expect a lot of things from that uh, rat called uh, Dimi. And this game is going to be dedicated to our viewers in Portugal. Oh, Ooh. Por uh, a country with the national flower is the lavender and the national dish is the bacalao. Mm -hmm. Which, in case you are uh, wondering what is uh, bacalao, it's cod. <laughs> <laughs> but in Portuguese, <laughs> I think I think because it's very similar to the word bacala, the code in Spanish, you know. So, right. and it's a fishing country, one of the most powerful uh, navies in the history, the Portuguese one. Mm. There's a there's a famous story. The Spanish had a good a good navy, didn't they? I, I seem to remember something about a Spanish armada once. Do you? Uh... Oh, I can give you lots of details of that. Yes, it was a, had suffered some incident on their way to England. They got the, some of the ships got destroyed uh, by the weather, and then they have to come back uh, around uh, Ireland, where some of the Spanish lads decided to remain in Ireland, and that's why there are a lot of Irish people with dark hair. <laughs> that's actually, you know, historic uh, through, and then. Came back, the Armada came back to Spain, like, what the fuck, that was, <laughs> then it went very well. But what many people seem doesn't know, especially in England, is that next year, the English try the same. You know, let's, this is our chance, let's fuck up the Spanish now, they are weak and all like that. So they did the English Armada, and it was even a bigger disaster. <laughs> to the point that the war lasted another 30 years. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, yeah, we don't get taught that, funnily enough. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because of uh, all the big ships, all the galleons of the Spanish Armada, obviously, they didn't suffer that much damage or anything like that. Or, uh, you know, because they were absolutely packing battleships. <laughs> so when the English uh, went, you know, ah, let's go, oh my God, they're still there. Let's keep going, let's go to Portugal. Let's put a new king in Portugal. And they choose some random guy to be the new king of Portugal. But they for didn't have an account that nobody in Portugal liked that guy either. <laughs> That's like modern days, isn't it? <laughs> Still do that. <laughs> oh, dude. <Oof. laughs> yeah, the Spanish rolled up and said, fuck this weather. <laughs> The Skaven deck, I mean, to be fair, there could have just been two, right? Like, it was just, for some reason, he put this one on the LOS as well. That, that was a bit weird. Yeah, they get the last laugh. That's true. That's true. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> no, I'm not Irish, uh, Tony. <laughs> as you very well know. <laughs> I love that ro the rogue is just blitzing to reposition every turn. <laughs> That's the oh, Jimmy <laughs> 3. Jimmy 3 is a stand. Seems there's been Jimmy 1 and Jimmy 2. <laughs> oh, God. Diced. The storm vermin. Oh, I guess he was going to blitz with him and run back, and then, then that's when the, uh, the, the perfect defense stopped that. Eliod. I, I like that his two best players are Elliot and Dimmy. That's pretty good, isn't it? The double act. The legendary double act of Elliot and Dimmy. <laughs> Those were the days. They don't do the CCL podcast anymore, I think. Yeah, no. They or or they, they still do. do. I don't think they do, but uh, they're still a double act, aren't they? We've still yes, got the they clips. Forever. They will forever be a double act. <laughs> yeah. And now they're back in five idiots. I've been so there fucking you go. obsessed with rats oh, that you're about to go on Everything holiday, comes together. 
And mm. like, you can't even fucking the fight, universe like, finds a way. Uh, you just decide by yes. more fucking rats. <laughs> what the fuck? Why the fuck would anyone play that much fucking rats? Jesus Christ. There's the, there's the four of the five idiots. The fifth one's Jack Bull. Um, oh, wow. Rick is in your, By the way, Rick, many chances that Rick has been a father for a second time this weekend. I don't have any update or anything. Mm. But uh, he was saying that the baby was coming this weekend. Mm. Yeah, I mean, knows. I am the opinion that uh, his wife should be the one, you know, making that call, but it's all right. <laughs> <laughs> rat Dacker is rough, but so is a normal rat drive. Like, you know, Skaven are great at scoring, you know? Great at scoring touchdowns, not so great, and kind of bad at stalling till turn eight. So... And Dacker this uh, rat team is not uh, anything special. I mean, it's... no, it's down TV. He's got a wizard, a babe, and an apple. There you go. And, and uh, Necro have uh, the strength for a uh, tackle wolf. So yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This guy can. This guy can just. He doesn't even have to be where he is, right? This guy can just can just stand here and like what the fuck do you do how do you get past him <laughs> brutal but i mean not a fan of a normal offense against against necro as well like it's tough isn't it like that's the, that's the thing like i i don't think the rat dacker is very good either and i don't like the rat dacker but Right, you've got to think of the normal right offense. Like, how do you start till turn eight against Necro? Anyway, it's not easy, is it? Oh, here comes the uh, finally. Four. Gets the hit. Juggernaut. Timmy. The perfect killing machine. Yeah. I mean, he is—he is a fucking brilliant player. To be fair, like. That's a hell of a stat line, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? It's just, it's just the wild yes. animal and the loner, really. Like, if you take away those two things, like, if he works, he's fucking brilliant. He didn't pile on, so... We couldn't see the animation of the pylon of the roger, but I hope, I hope we will see it. I hope so, yeah. I've, I've almost got PTSD from that after playing, you know, the early... Early Blood Bowl 2 and like everybody had a claw pom rogue. <laughs> <laughs> God. Well, pretty, really good turn from Diamond there, wasn't it? You could argue a bit of a mistake from the Craggle, uh, allowing that. Flesh you get hit. Because Stan, you know, obviously he's got to remember they don't really have Stan Firm this game. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, 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 oh. that is unlucky as fuck. <laughs> there you go. Try proved wrong. They're not that fast when they quad skull. <laughs> <laughs> I like the Dacker versus Rat versus Necro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Take it all back. <laughs> I take it all back, you know, it's a masterful play. <laughs> I mean, he could uh, kill the strength for <laughs> He could, yeah. Wolf now, if he gets lucky. Yeah, he really could. We might He's see going the for it. On. He's going for it. Gets the pow. Gets the pow. It has to pile on. Yes! <laughs> oh, beautiful. <laughs> Diced. Diced. Oh my god. Diced. <laughs> Absolutely ruined. Wait, doesn't the wolf and the rogue have the same animation on the floor? You know, like the same model but with a different skin? Oh, maybe. And one is looking to, you know, looking the, to the right and the other looking to the left? Yeah, it looks that way, doesn't it? Shall, yeah. we, shall we stop and have a look? <laughs> It's one of these cases of a reuse the re re nah, re nah, 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 different. Nah, 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 different. different enough, different enough. Yeah, different enough. 
Yeah, it was pretty cool animation, isn't it? But he's done his job. By the way, the yeah, maybe, you know, the, the pylon, I was thinking, maybe the apple is not, you know, a doctor. It's just the, a pylon, you know, the, the a guy piles on, on the injured player and could be better, you know, the, heli, the healing pylon that is only a stun <laughs> yeah. or dead. It's just pylon. All right, 50% chance there. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic takes try. Almost as good as the tricks the takes of my guy of the guy on my YouTube. Which is uh as YouTube comments go, it's probably the stupidest comment I've ever read on my on my YouTube. The the most idiotic comment I've ever read on my YouTube. So there you go. Be careful, uh, that could cause you one beware. It might cost me one beer, yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, like, like the guy that you went when you were playing one day. <laughs> just great on chat. You, Hello, everybody. You welcome my guest. Me, one, one subscriber for your YouTube channel. <laughs> <laughs> you're, not even, you're not even that good. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, you are not that good. You have lost one subscriber for your YouTube channel. <laughs> yeah. Brilliant. Brilliant. I'll screenshot it so you can see. It's really funny. I'll put it here. I don't mind mocking this guy publicly. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay, isn't it? No one minds. No one minds. There you go. It's in my Discord now, the picture. Alright, alright. Then put the link to your Discord in the chat so you know people do. can join the Discord. The three or four people that are not there. Yep, that's a good idea. This is the comment. Yeah. Oh my god, what? Oh, it starts glorious. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I want to read it aloud, aloud, you know, here for the chat because the half. Oh, Jimmy3 is injured. Miss next game. Mm. Helsing DS. Right, that is 19 hours ago. So this is something from today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was he, he just wrote it on like a on a, the guide to the Chaos Renegades. Okay. Problem with a lot of players like Jimmy, they only really understand meta. They miss the nuance of risk management and try to play as safe as possible. They are essentially the rock players in poker. They persist late into turnies, but they rarely ever come out on top because a competent cowboy will use their safe and predictable nature to bleed them dry. The Rat Ogre is one of the best players if made to be a ball pursuer, cage smasher with one simple skill. <laughs> Bro! <laughs> the skill increases big guy reliability and comes in clutch the more dice you roll with them, such as those already provided by Frenzy. Animal savagery just make him less likely to waste blitzes. It might even be worth exploring him as a ball carrier <laughs> in the context of renegades. <laughs> Chaos renegades are actually highly dependent on Rat Ogre Minotaur, as they thrive on a scattered pitch with multiple big guys. No player is better than a scattering the pitch than a big guy with frenzy Juggernaut and break tackle. The rest is all. About <laughs> Sorry, <clears throat> the rest is all about grab, side step, fend, big hand, two heads, leap, long legs, dodge, whilst minimizing the time you rat ogre minotaur is spending proximity to more than one player. Punish players who rely too heavily on big messy scrums through divide and conquer. You do not want to pursue a heavy presence of a guard at all as a result. <laughs> yep. I mean, wow. 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 Yeah. Yeah. I've seen the S. Is this guy been uh, in the channel here? Maybe he's joking. <laughs> I hope he's joking. <laughs> <laughs> I really, I really hope it for his sake that he's joking. I mean, Jeepers. bro. 
Yeah, maybe, you know, oh. I don't know, maybe a skill that makes the rat ogres much more reliable. <laughs> Block. <laughs> Yeah, I know. I don't think he is joking. Uh, right, just say right. This is a perfect defense here by Diomed, who has managed to uh, not really help himself. But it's hard, though, right? But he's left this on, which is the the block in the uh, pushes, right? Which is like the worst thing you can do, right? Interesting, isn't it? Also, it was bad from uh, Crag to set up the other way. The strength four should have been here, right? So that he could push, push, and then push him forward, push him forward push him forward and then uh, blitz his way through. So mistake by Crag on the setup and mistake by Diamond though like this guy should just be one one over, right? Um so yeah that's a bit of a mistake there. Also at some point the Roger was Kaz but uh Apple was used. Uh but yeah that 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 comment is amazing isn't it? It's a uh, I mean and I, I guess I guess the list of skills you know grab side step fend behind blah blah no that is for the rest of the team. Yes, yeah. I Which being so. Chaos Renegades, I don't know how they're gonna get, you know, set the step. No. Or leap. No. Or dodge. <laughs> no. Or long legs. I mean, long legs. As long legs change it in Blood Bowl of the Three. Yeah, it's, it's even worse. <laughs> ah, fantastic then. It's literally even worse, yeah. Ah, the elf, yeah, the elf could get. Yeah, oh, they yeah, they can have an elf, yes. Yeah. How many elves they can have? One. Oof, that guy has a lot of skills to do to get. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm not a cowboy who would punish yeah, the, uh, exactly. the meta I'm slaves. I'm not a cowboy. I'm not a cowboy. Mm. Oh god. I mean, to be fair, the elf is the real star of the team. But uh, flip me. Yeah, the best player in your team is a lineman from another team. That's the thing, though. Like, you know, like, that's what we realized with, with Chaos Renegades was the fact that, you know, a Dark Elf lineman or a Wood Elf, like a Wood Elf lineman especially, is like the star of a lot of teams, isn't he? Like, for fuck's sake, it's mental. Yeah, yeah. 7, uh, 3, 4, uh, really, really good. I said it, I only give correct things. Fair enough. I mean, I have to admit, this guy, you know, wrote the thing. So this guy is coming from somewhere. You know, oh, this, yeah. is, this is not just a casual be where you just want to know. This guy knows you, Jimmy. This guy knows you. Yeah. I think he's been in China because, well, Helsing, yes, I mean, Helsing is a very common uh, name, you know, the sun always rings a bell from the Dracula thing, but. Uh, Actually, I like the photo, which is, I think he's wearing an actual cowboy hat. Ah, right. I think. Yeah, yeah, it looks like it. Yeah. I mean, it looks like a monkey, you know, I mean, he's, uh, <laughs> like only because it's tiny. I'm not calling the guy a monkey, you see, he looks like that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, that does look like a cowboy hat for sure, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that was on the, it was on my Chaos Renegades Blood Bowl 3 guide, and you can see it in the Discord. Yeah, 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 yeah. It looks like one of these uh, NFT uh, images of the monkey, the side of the monkeys. Yeah. yeah. Oh Again, because I'm seeing it uh, tiny. I mean, I have a big screen, you know? I zoomed screen. in, I zoomed in. It, it, you could tell it was, it, it's pretty sure it's a cowboy hat. And yeah, it, 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 does, it does give the impression of that. And uh, not saying, of course, that the guy has a monkey brain. He's probably got a peanut brain. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Nah, jokes aside, I disagree with the statements of Helsing Yes, yes, yeah, and yeah, not, not obviously not insulting him, but uh, it's weird, isn't it? It's a weird that people think like that because, like, like that's implying that he thinks it's good and it is, a, it's genuinely a weakness in people's game to not have a right ogre ball carrier. Like, it's one thing to say that a right ogre ball carrier is fun. But again, I don't like guides like that because you can decide fun for yourself. Like, that's the way I look at it. Do you know what I mean? Like, a lot of people will say, like, you know, about Bonehead Podcast and Rebel and stuff and just say, do what's fun and that. And it's like, I don't, you know, people don't need advice on what's fun, do they? Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah, like, <laughs> you should have fun playing the game. Yes, that's the whole thing. Yeah. Like, if, if you want to have fun playing a fucking skink team, have fun playing a skink team. Rick did, didn't he? He, yes. didn't ask, he didn't ask advice on how to build a lizard man team and then say, oh, well, I'm just going all skinks because it's fun. <laughs> he just felt like having fun, so he had fun. It's simple. Oh, God. 
<laughs> no try. Chunter's way better than that. Like Chunter knows how to play Blood Bowl. It's like in Arian, isn't it? Just got some like some weird ideas that are incorrect. <laughs> incorrect or sponsored. Hmm. There you go. Yeah, I mean, yes, you you know, have fun playing any way the game, you know, it's, it's perfectly fine. That's that's all you're supposed to do. If you enjoy coming back home after work and play a game, a couple of games of Blood Bowl versus the in the single player, just to destroy the other team and have an ultra powerful team and just get cast and all that, and have a laugh here and there, that's probably fine. And nobody has anything, you know, to say to you about anything. You are, um, this is the way I play and enjoy playing this way. Mm -hmm. But. Don't try to sell that as a thing that, you know, like, oh, no, no, this is the proper way. This is, you, you don't understand, you know, the thing like that. Because it's not. Yeah. And a rat ogre ball carrier is a terrible idea. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Unequivocally a terrible idea and not something as crazy as Chuntra or Inarian would ever condone. Like, they would never condone a, a bloody rat ogre no. ball carrier. I mean, eh... Uh, uh, Scoring a one turner, trying to score a one turner with a Croxigor is possible if the Croxigor gets extra movement. So you could be able to do it, and if it happens, it will be absolutely hilarious. Yeah. But then don't come and look at this play. You guys never thought about this kind of play, eh? because that way the Croxigor can blitz through the uh, the last line. It's like, what? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and it's like that, that's and you know people could ask for fun ideas as well, right? Like you know if they, like let's say you've played you know GTA Five, you'd say you've owned GTA Five for like seven years or however long it's been out, and you could be like, you know, I'm a bit bored. Has anyone got any ideas for something fun? And they could say, yeah, you know, you could try, you know, running around with a rocket launcher shooting tanks, right? Something like that. So that's fair enough. And like asking for fun ideas is fine as well. But but it's just weird when people ask for advice on like Blood Bowl, and then. Like I just don't think fun enters into it. You know? Well, there you go. Look, we've gone. Um, we've gone for an early score, going for the win in normal time. Not what I would have done. But I guess in a way, right, th this kind of works because he's got the natty, hasn't he? So if you score early, he might not be able to stall it out. Um, but that seems very dodgy. How many players has he got? Three, six, eight players. I would not feel confident giving. Time, uh, but yeah, it's more like can you turn him over in those five turns? It's, it's interesting, isn't it? Because if you just score on turn eight, he just scores with a natty. But he has got a wizard. He might be able to stall this out. Super interesting. 2013, crazy. All right, you can see, try that. I'm not. I'm not the most, <laughs> the best person at thinking of fun things to do. <laughs> Um, you could shoot the, there's a, like a, there's a pistol, like a, like a ray gun thing, like a gravity gun, I don't know what it's called, you could shoot that at cars and flip them around, right, that's fun, I don't know, something like that, you could, oh wow, a blitz, well it looks an amazing play now by Crag, flip me, <laughs> fair enough, Tony. <laughs> yeah, and fully enough, Fluffy Beard. Oh, it's the same thing in, as well in reserve, reverse. What you often see on uh, oh wow, there's another removal. Eliod, the one turn he was going for the one turn, and Apple comes in, and the one in nine. Oh wow, it's all this. To be fair, this match has been pretty amazing, and we've mostly just been talking about that idiotic comment and another shit. But it's actually been a pretty, a pretty wild game. I did like I did like setting up on the LOS as well. To be fair, just go for the uh, oh wow, holy shit! Oh, I thought it was I thought it was a fleshy. Right, it's not a big deal at all. I literally thought it was a fleshy because I knew this fleshy was based, and I thought the other fleshy was over there for some reason. I like going for the one turn, just you know, go two one up and then just roll the one turn because he has only got eight players. It's a bit dodgy, isn't it? But now he's got even less. Oh, diced. Oh no, he blitzed. He blitzed. Rogue Dimmy, glorious. Gets the removal. 
Yeah, he should have. He should have definitely moved these in before a one in nine dodge. Yeah, yeah. That, that was poor play by uh, Craig. These four should have all moved, right? Or and this guy. Or these five players should have all moved before this one. Even if you're going to move somebody through afterwards, I don't know who you would move through afterwards. But just get them in first. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh man. And again, he didn't even have to go there, right? He could have just gone here, and then he could have punched him, and then that would have had him based anyway. I guess this does let him make two blocks, but was there any need to get that extra block? Probably not. Certainly not to do an extra GFI. Some of the Kaz. Flip me. It's looking real bad for Diamed now. Really bad. I don't know if I'm here still around, but um, yeah, it's pretty, uh, it's pretty crazy. Aloe jam toast. Man, I might make a team called Meta Slaves. That's a good idea, isn't it? So this this apple was huge, wasn't it? He had to apple that, I think. Amazing. And yeah, just sideline cage it. It's not great. All right, I'm back. Hello. My cat, uh, my cat was playing with a bag, so I had to pay attention for a short while to make a video for my mom. Oh, lovely. <laughs> I will fucking drop There's something kick, happened. Jesus. I can't remember what, but uh, it's been thrilling, as you can imagine. <laughs> oh, wow. Juggernaut. Juggernaut has been great on this Roger. And, uh... I imagine if that Roger was carrying the ball. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. And imagine if you had break pro. tackle, break tackle, juggernaut. You can't stop that the uh, roger if it blitzes. It just keeps going. Yeah. <laughs> I know, right? Driver. Imagine having to watch you watch that. It's been a pretty great match. Um, the there was a blitz which which killed the natty. So then uh, Diamond had to apple it. Um, but now the natty has got the ball and is in range. But there are tackles all around. It'd have to be a grab, grab ogre, wouldn't it? The the ogre would have to be grab or the troll. Should he have surfed that gutter? I mean, you could certainly argue so. Yes, he had to go for the. I agree. I agree. He had to go for the blitz in. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you got to You got to hit this. He's just gonna. He's just gonna bolt and score. Yeah. 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 Which is uh, yeah the, the, the actual Diomed is here in the chat. Yeah. Um. Yeah. What? What could you? Could, was it gonna be a one D? Without it. I like the Wiz because you've got a chance to one turn if he scores a game, right? So. Yes. You get the upper hand in the shootout. Yeah, it depends. I don't know how dodgy it was. I don't. It, I didn't pay that much attention. You know, I would have to go back and pause it and stuff and then see exactly what the best player was. But, like, that was real good value, Wizard, wasn't it, at the end of the day? It makes the touchdown basically assured. So I think it's fine. Probably. Now is uh, the time for the uh, Necro to try to score. Oh, God. Yep, good luck, Jam Toast. You'll need it. It's Hava, Hava, Hava Kababra. Hava Kababra, Tony. Hava Kababra. Dimio. Abra Kebabra. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Dimio. Dimio Abra Kebabra. <laughs> Dimio Abra Kebabra. Yes. <laughs> All right, Jan Toes. Hope you had fun with the with the game. Why you're playing again after years? That's I think I guess it's a story for another time. Yeah, yeah. That's Einstein's uh, thing of the <laughs> what. Insanity repeating the same thing over yes, and over, exactly. expecting different results. <laughs> yep. 
That's us all right. <laughs> I, but this is also the most common thing, you know, people playing Blood Bowl, stopping Blood Bowl for a few years and then coming back and the cycle continues. <laughs> yep, yep. It really is. I'm well blitzing with him. Interesting. Lots of uh, potential targets. Oh, Juggernaut again. <laughs> Have another can. Have <laughs> 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 another can. <laughs> Bloodweiser, but not Bloodweiser, Budweiser Armus. <laughs> but, oh, I don't know, all sorts of things. No, 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 no. I think the, the name the name is very easy. Estelaris are toys. <laughs> Black Eye Guaranteed. Yes. <laughs> oh, Kaula Kaul and G is in the building. Fua, the legend. The legend. <laughs> I told you the one about the swarm lot. <laughs> we need something like that from you, Kaylon. Some kind of soundbite to do with the swarm lot. <laughs> I can play it because <laughs> you're just, worthy just, of a soundbite. Just, just say swarm lot in Spanish, Kaylon. Just say el señor del enjambre. Yes, that's it. Yes, that's... <laughs> oh, well, this is looking like a turn. You know, so that was a pretty good idea for the uh, Necro to score early. You can't, can't begrudge them the scoring early, but yeah, probably should have dodged in for the uh, hit on the ball. Because there's uh, there's no sidestep, is there, on the natty? So you could have even gone, you could have even gone for the six plus dodge in to surf him, or the five plus dodge in to hit. But just standing in the way like that was, was never going to work. But two two, the the natty might not work, right? There is a chance, yes, and that is of, uh, a tendency to disappoint. Yeah, I know that Wait. better than most. <laughs> Loads of cars. So Jam Toast is playing Blue Bowl because Keolan uh, gave him a... Oof. 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 Keolan, disgusting. <laughs> Just on time for Blue Bowl 3. Good job, Kevlan. <laughs> <laughs> what a scumbag. The worst of the worst. <laughs> it's a good point. Oh, yeah, I wouldn't, but there's an argument for doing so. There right? is an argument, but if you get caught and you get uh, sent off, you lose the game. Yeah. Yeah, it's better if you're uh, like if it's even, so that at least it goes to OT. Yeah, not when you're behind. Yeah, when you're behind. But oh wow, oh wow, the corner kick as well. Ooh. Five out of eight. It just it's a touchback. It's not. It's not. Oh. But it's a pick up handoff pass, isn't it? So it's still pretty easy. Twos, but lots of twos. Yeah, lots of twos. Uh... Oh, there's a one. There was the first, the, there was the reroll. If this was Blood Bowl, uh, Blood Bowl yeah, 3. This will be no problem at all. Yeah, yeah it's crazy that, but not, that one The, the quickest easy. snap also makes the one now much, much easier. Yep. Cheers. <laughs> oh, and that's it. The click rat, click and so on. Once again, uh, prove. Be the better uh, tactic. <laughs> Brilliant. And Diomed and his team of a Roger and a few friends pass to the next round. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. It's great though, isn't it? It's great. The, the Dimmy the Dimmy Roger meme is like amazing. Absolutely. Roger for Dimmy too. Absolutely love it. So yeah, that's fantastic. Congrats to Diomed. Commiserations to Crag79. Thank you very much, Fimey. It's been glorious having you in the booth. As always, a pleasure to be here, and I hope our viewers in Portugal enjoy it while they're having a nice dinner of bacalao. <laughs> Glorious. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.